नमस्कार आई अमित कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल इन आई एम डेज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग द हाईलाइट्स फॉर टूडेज वेदर ब्रीफिंग आर दैट द डिप्रेशन ओवर वे ऑफ बेंगोल एट ज्वाइनिंग टू साउथ उड़ीसा एंड नॉर्थ सी ए पी हैज क्रॉस्ड साउथ उड़ीसा कोस्ट टूडे मॉर्निंग नियर गोपालपुर एंड इज करेंटली लेइंग ओवर साउथ उड़ीसा एंड इट इज प्रिडिक्टेड टू फर्दर मूव वेस्टवर्ड अक्रॉस साउथ उड़ीसा एंड छत्तीसगढ़ एंड वी कैन इन टू ए वेल मार्क लो प्रेशर एरिया ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स अंडर द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ दिस डिप्रेशन इन्हांस्ड ट्रेनफॉल एक्टिविटीज प्रिडिक्टेड ओवर महाराष्ट्र स्टेट ड्यूरिंग ट्वेंटी सेवन टू ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ ऑफ सेप्टेंबर एंड ओवर गुजरात स्टेट फ्रॉम ट्वेंटी एट टू थर्टी एथ ऑफ सेप्टेंबर विद द पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ एक्सट्रीमली हैवी रेनफॉल ओवर नॉर्थ कोंकण एंड नॉर्थ मध्य महाराष्ट्र ऑन ट्वेंटी एट एंड ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ गुजरात रीजन ऑन ट्वेंटी एट एंड सौराष्ट्र कच्छ ऑन ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ ऑफ सेप्टेंबर so as we have briefed you yesterday that there was a well marked low pressure area over bay of bengal adjacent to south odisha and north andhra andhra pradesh coast so yesterday evening it intensified into a depression and moving westward it crossed uh, odisha coast to uh, today morning at around 4:30 ist so uh, currently it is located over south odisha as you can see over uh, in the graphics and then you can see that it is forecasted to move westward and then gradually we can into a well marked low pressure area in next 24 hours so under the influence of the that uh, earlier the well marked low pressure area and then the depression very heavy rainfall heavy to very heavy rainfall was recorded over parts of odisha telangana rayalaseema and marathwada and heavy rainfall was also recorded over chatisgarh vidarbha uh, bengal konkan madhya maharashtra coastal andhra pradesh north interior karnataka and tamil nadu apart from this system he- very heavy to very heavy rainfall was also recorded over assam and meghalaya now as uh, i have already briefed to you that uh, this low pre- uh, depression will be moving westward and then uh, weakening into a uh, well marked low pressure area so now if we look at the day one warnings then you can see in this map clearly that uh, the regions over north peninsular india and west india namely telangana vidarbha एंटायर महाराष्ट्र स्टेट नॉर्थ इंटीरियर कर्नाटका एंड वेस्ट मध्य प्रदेश आर गिवन विथ हैवी टू वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल वॉर्निंग्स विथ ऑरेंज कलर एंड द एडजॉइनिंग रीजन्स ऑफ दीज एरियाज लाइक ईस्ट मध्य प्रदेश छत्तीसगढ़ उड़ीसा आंध्र प्रदेश साउथ इंटीरियर कर्नाटका सी के एंड गुजरात रीजन आर इशूड विद हैवी रेनफॉल वॉर्निंग अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस केरला इज ऑल्सो इशूड विद वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल वॉर्निंग विद ऑरेंज कलर टूडे एंड तमिलनाडु विद येलो कलर ऑफ हैवी रेनफॉल हैवी रेनफॉल वॉर्निंग इज ऑल्सो इशूड फॉर बंगाल असम मेघालय एंड अंडमान निकोबार एरिया फॉर नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स थंडर स्ट्रॉम एक्टिविटी विल ऑल्सो अकम्पनी ऑल दीज रीजन्स एंड ओवर द ईस्ट कोस्ट स्ट्रॉन्ग सस्टेन्ड कस्टी विंड्स विल ऑल्सो प्रिवेल नाउ इफ यू आर लुकिंग एट द वॉर्निंग्स फॉर ट्वेंटी एट्थ ऑफ सेप्टेंबर सो इन दिस यू कैन सी दैट एज वी हैव ऑलरेडी प्रिडिक्टेड दैट द सिस्टम विल मूव वेस्टवर्ड सो यू कैन सी दैट नॉर्थ कोंकण नॉर्थ मध्य महाराष्ट्र एंड साउथ गुजरात रीजन आर इशूड विद रेड कलर वॉर्निंग्स for extremely heavy rainfall and their adjoining region of marathwada is issued with very heavy rainfall with orange color remaining parts of vidarbha west mp saurashtra telangana north interior karnataka are issued with heavy rainfall warning heavy rainfall warning is also issued for coastal karnataka kerala and in the northeast for uh, assam meghalaya and nmmt in these regions Uh, where extremely heavy rainfall and heavy rainfall warnings are issued thunderstorm warnings will also accompany and over the east coast and west coast sustained uh, gusty winds or strong surface winds will also prevail now if you look for the warnings for 29th of september then you can see that as the system will further move towards east uh, west then you can see that extremely heavy rainfall warnings are issued for parts of saurashtra kutch north konkan north madhya maharashtra and very heavy rainfall warnings are issued for gujarat region so red color warnings are issued for extremely heavy cases and orange color warnings are issued for very heavy uh, rainfall cases 
over the northeast you can see that heavy rainfall warning is issued for uh, nagaland manipur mizoram and tripura you can also see that over east india northeast india and parts of uh, eastern ghats the thunderstorm activity will continue on 29th of september now if we look for the warnings for 30th of september then you can see that the rainfall activity over the west coast will decrease slightly as the system will further weaken and move westward so you can see that very heavy rainfall warning is issued orange color for uh, so rastra kach heavy rainfall warning is issued for gujarat region konkan and madhya maharashtra over central india chatisgarh is also issued with heavy rainfall warning over northeast you can see that assam meghalaya and nagaland manipur mizoram and tripura are also issued for heavy rainfall warning thunderstorm activity will continue over northeast and east coast of india for first of october you can see that the rainfall activity will further decrease over west coast and heavy rainfall warning is issued for saurashtra kach konkan and madhya maharashtra and coastal karnataka and over the east coast and northeast india you can see that entire northeast india has been issued with heavy rainfall warning and over chatisgarh and odisha also heavy rainfall warning is issued and this uh, rainfall activity is uh, mainly particularly due to an occurrence of a cyclonic circulation which will uh, develop over bay of bengal on 30th of september and then it is predicted to further intensify into a low pressure area over bay of bengal on 1st of october so uh, under uh, the influence of that fresh low pressure area over bay of bengal you can see that on 2nd and 3rd of october heavy rainfall warnings are issued for entire east india and northeast india over central india also uh, over madhya pradesh and uh, vidarbha heavy rainfall warnings are issued and over west india for konkan goa uh, coastal Karnat karnataka and madhya maharashtra heavy rainfall warnings are issued now if you look at the five day fisherman warnings then you can see that under the influence of this depression and then under the influence of fresh low pressure area which will form on 1st of october you can see that entire bay of bengal uh, apart from the northern part of bay of bengal fisherman warnings are issued over the west coast the fisherman warnings are mainly issued for gujarat coast and maharashtra coast you can join us on our mosam app mosam website on our various social media handles and stay tuned with latest weather update namaskar jai hind